Elon Musk's revolutionary startup Neuralink has just received the green light from the U.S. Food and Drug Administration to begin human trials. This marks a major milestone in the company's mission to merge the human brain with artificial intelligence. For those unfamiliar with the project, Neuralink aims to implant tiny chips into the human brain to help cure neurological conditions like Alzheimer's, dementia, and spinal cord injuries. This technology, once realized, could potentially transform the way we interact with the world around us, pushing the boundaries of what it means to be human. However, as with all pioneering technologies, it's not without its share of controversies. Critics question the ethical implications, safety, and potential for misuse of such a device. Now let's take a closer look at what this could mean for the future of technology and the human brain. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to control a computer with just your mind? What if you could communicate without uttering a single word? These questions might sound like science fiction, but they are actually the driving force behind a revolutionary technology currently being developed by Elon Musk's company, Neuralink. Imagine a world where you can surf the internet, play your favorite video games, and even control prosthetic limbs, all with the power of thought. This is the reality Neuralink is striving to create using a cutting edge device known as the Link. This brain computer interface implanted directly into the brain aims to bridge the gap between the human mind and the digital world around us. But it's not just about convenience or even accessibility for those with physical disabilities. Neuralink's ambitious vision extends to the therapeutic realm as well, with the potential to treat a range of neurological disorders and mental health conditions. The possibilities are as vast as they are exciting, yet as with any groundbreaking technology, Neuralink's journey hasn't been without its share of controversy. Concerns have been raised about the ethical implications of such a device, and questions linger about safety, particularly given that the technology involves invasive brain surgery. There are also worries about the potential for misuse and the broader societal implications. How will this technology change our relationship with machines? What does it mean for our privacy, our autonomy, our very sense of self? In addition, Neuralink has faced criticism for its animal testing practices with allegations of animal cruelty prompting investigations by multiple government agencies. The company, however, maintains its commitment to humane and ethical treatment of animals. Despite these concerns, Neuralink presses forward its sights set on a future where humans and machines are more integrated than ever before. The approval for human clinical trials marks a significant milestone in this endeavor, though many challenges still lie ahead. Now let's delve into the journey of Neuralink, the company pioneering this groundbreaking technology. Elon Musk founded Neuralink in 2016 with a profound vision. Known for his audacious goals and futuristic ventures, Musk aimed to blend the boundaries between humans and technology, creating a world where our minds could interact directly with digital devices. Neuralink, a brain implant company, was born from this vision its purpose to develop a brain-computer interface that could be implanted directly into the human brain. The company's device, known as the Link, is designed to connect our minds to external electronics. Musk's claims about the potential of the Link are nothing short of revolutionary. He believes it could be used for therapeutic purposes, helping those with neurological disorders or injuries regain lost abilities, but he doesn't stop there. Musk envisions a future where the link could connect the human mind to supercomputers, exponentially increasing our cognitive abilities. Despite the excitement, the journey has not been without its challenges. Neuralink's bold mission has been met with concerns about animal welfare, safety, and the company's ability to responsibly oversee the development of such an invasive medical device. But these hurdles have not deterred Musk or Neuralink from pushing forward on this pioneering path. But how exactly does Neuralink plan to achieve its ambitious vision? At the heart of Neuralink lies a device called the Link. It's more than just a piece of hardware. It's a gateway to a whole new realm of possibilities. The Link is a brain-computer interface, a device designed to bridge the gap between our organic brain and the digital world of computers. This connection is made possible using electrode-laced wires implanted in the brain, forming a high-bandwidth link between the mind and machine. But this isn't a one-way street. It's a dialogue 
a conversation between you and the computer. You think, and the computer responds, creating a seamless integration that could allow us to control computers with our thoughts alone. Imagine, if you will, being able to communicate without words, to express thoughts and ideas instantaneously, or to manipulate digital objects just by thinking about it. For those with paralysis or traumatic brain injuries, this could mean a newfound ability to interact with the world around them, breaking down barriers that were once considered insurmountable. But it's not just about communication and control. Elon Musk, the visionary behind Neuralink, has suggested that the link could be used for therapeutic purposes. Imagine a future where conditions like Parkinson's, Alzheimer's, or even mental health disorders could be managed or even cured through direct interaction with our brain. The possibilities are as vast as they are exciting. And let's not forget the grand vision of connecting the human mind to supercomputers. This could open up a world of opportunities for cognitive enhancement, potentially supercharging our ability to learn, create, and solve complex problems. But as with all great leaps forward, this technology brings with it a host of questions and concerns. There are technical challenges, of course, such as the potential movement of wires in the brain and the risk of the chip overheating. But beyond that, there are ethical considerations, questions about animal welfare, and concerns about how such a powerful technology might be used or misused. As promising as this technology sounds, it has not been without its challenges. The journey to human trials has been a tumultuous one for Neuralink. Indeed, the road to this pivotal moment has been riddled with obstacles and setbacks. One of the most significant challenges was the initial rejection by the Food and Drug Administration due to safety concerns. The FDA was particularly worried about potential movement of wires in the brain and overheating of the chip. These concerns brought about a necessary pause, a chance for Neuralink to revisit its technology and ensure its safety. But the challenges didn't stop there. Neuralink also faced allegations of animal cruelty. Accusations were made that the company had not followed regulations in transporting potentially hazardous pathogens during its animal testing phase. An animal rights group even sued the University of California Davis over experiments conducted for Neuralink, demanding the release of photos related to these experiments. Neuralink had to navigate this ethical minefield maintaining its commitment to humane and ethical treatment of animals while pushing the boundaries of scientific understanding. Despite these hurdles, Neuralink persevered. The company worked tirelessly to address the FDA's safety concerns, refining its technology, and demonstrating its commitment to safe and responsible development of its brain-computer interface. This relentless pursuit of innovation and safety has finally paid off with the FDA approving Neuralink for the first clinical trial of its experimental device in humans. This approval signifies that Neuralink has passed safety preclinical testing and bench testing, a massive milestone in the journey of this groundbreaking technology. It's a testament to Neuralink's commitment to making this technology safe and effective. And it brings us one step closer to a future where the human mind can be connected to supercomputers. The road to human trials has been anything but smooth. It has been a journey marked by regulatory hurdles, ethical debates, and technological challenges. But through it all, Neuralink has shown resilience and commitment to its mission. Now having received the green light for human trials, what does the future hold for Neuralink? The future of Neuralink is as exciting as it is uncertain. This revolutionary technology has the potential to redefine our understanding of the human brain and how we interact with the world around us. As we venture into this new frontier, it's important to consider both the potential benefits and challenges that lie ahead. Neuralink's primary goal is to create a symbiotic relationship between humans and artificial intelligence. This could open up a world of possibilities from helping people with paralysis regain movement to enhancing our cognitive abilities and even allowing us to communicate telepathically. Imagine being able to control your computer or smartphone with your thoughts or even access the internet directly from your brain. The potential applications are mind-boggling. However, with such groundbreaking technology come significant ethical and safety considerations. The device involves implanting electrode-laced wires into the brain, a procedure that is not without risks. 
Concerns have been raised about the potential movement of wires in the brain and overheating of the chip. Furthermore, Neuralink has faced scrutiny over its animal testing procedures, with allegations of animal cruelty prompting investigations by multiple government agencies. Commercialization of the Neuralink device is still several years away. It's expected to take at least five to 10 years to reach the market, with the company now able to adapt its device design based on the results of upcoming human trials. The implications of this technology for sectors like healthcare, communication, and computing are vast. In healthcare, it could provide novel treatments for neurological disorders. In communication, it could fundamentally alter how we interact with each other and our devices. And in computing, it could usher in a new era of human-computer interaction. As we stand on the brink of this technological revolution, we can only imagine what the future holds. In the span of a few short years, Neuralink has taken us on quite a journey. Born from the ambitious vision of Elon Musk, the company has made significant strides in the field of brain-computer interfaces. The technology, known as the Link, is designed to be implanted in the brain, connecting the human mind to external electronics. This could potentially unlock new ways for people with paralysis or traumatic brain injuries to communicate and control computers with their thoughts. The road to human trials hasn't been smooth, with concerns raised about Musk's leadership, animal welfare issues, and the company's ability to responsibly oversee the development of such an invasive device. Yet, Neuralink has now received regulatory approval from the FDA for its first clinical trials in humans, a significant milestone that brings the company one step closer to realizing its vision. As for the future, it's expected that widespread brain implants are still several years away from commercialization. However, the potential is tremendous, with Musk claiming that the device could eventually connect the human mind to supercomputers. As we watch the story of Neuralink unfold, one thing is certain. Technology is about to redefine the limitations of the human brain. As we conclude our journey today at AI Future Hub, remember that you've stepped into the future where artificial intelligence shapes possibilities. Hope you've benefited from our cutting-edge content. If you haven't subscribed yet, now is the time. Show your support by hitting that like button. Share our videos and spread the future. Don't miss your chance to be with us again on this journey by subscribing, liking, and sharing. Until next time, keep exploring the future with us.